Hello and welcome back to Absolute Carnage. I think they found out where I hid the steam turbines. That was a that was an episode introduction and a half. Right into it. No warning. Straight to the good stuff. Straight to the raw carnage. Oh, well, we fixed it. No problem. Uh, so I might need to push my defenses here out a little bit. Or at least just kind of keep carrying on this line. Forever and ever. It's the never-ending line. Uh, what's your problem? You're just slow. Assemblers are slow. I'm gonna go grab some more coal. From right here. And then this. We can keep our furnaces kind of working forever now. Without really having to do too much interference, which is super nice. Inserters look pretty automated, which is also kind of awesome. Kind of. It's not uh, amazing of a setup, but it's definitely working. Then this can go there, and you can go on the back side. There we go. We got green science right there. Would you look at that? So where do we put it? I don't know. This is not really defended over here. We're kind of just hoping to bite our zone notice. Kind of snuck it in. Kind of snuck it in. Still have 100 belts. So belt-wise, we're doing pretty good. You can go there. You can go there. I don't know if they're just going to insert back and forth to each other. If they do, well, that's fine. Someone will eventually use it. So this is really undefended here now. I need to... I need to smelt way more. Uh... Oh, wow. It survived. Oh, wow. Okay. We're out of ammo down here. Ammo is totally out. How much ammo we got in there? Uh, 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 200 bullets. Nice. Nice. That was kind of sketchy. I might do this. I grab a chest. Put it in here and give you some bullets. Dump it all onto the belts. Okay. Make me happy. So this doesn't work anymore. They broke the other one. Actually, I'll just go like that. There you go. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So we do have a few turrets down there. It's starting to get a little dicey, though. This doesn't quite work. So this is kind of working, but not quite. So you're... You're just super slow. That's the whole problem here. But we do have green science going, so we could get military, which gives me grenades. Grenades are really expensive, though. But grenades are really good at off or pushing off an attack. So I do think it's worth my while. I do need the technology anyways, so might as well. Uh, the real push is into oil, so... We get flammables going ASAP. Actually, if we get military science, I can start collecting it a little bit. Buffer the military science, then get some of this, then get some of that. Get some oil up and running. So as soon as this tech is done, which doesn't really do much to be totally honest. We can uh Moving on to greater things. Get that military science up and running. This is really undefended down here now, though. So we're starting to be kind of defended, but not really. Until everything here is half destroyed. We're attacking over here again. Oy. 
Why you hate my pipe so much? They know. They know what those pipes connect to. Sneaky little hobbitses. Trixie. Hmm. I just heard something blow up. Oh, you just straight up kill the steam engine. Uh, okay, so I guess we need turrets a little bit higher up here. <laughs> if they're just killing the turrets here. Or killing the uh, turbines here. We're smelting down here now. This is looking good. This can go directly into ammo production now. Actually, hold on. Let's do this. I'm going to go half in here. So half to science. That's going to kind of cut in like that. And then the rest will go to ammo. And we'll make another turret line. So let's go side load in like that. And then from here, we'll make ammo. Make a double ammo. Because holy cow, do we need ammo. And we are going to make a rotating belt. Actually, I'm just going to connect into this rotating belt. If I move this turret. And I just side load in like that. Everybody's happy. I can do a couple of turrets here because I think eventually they're going to attack here. They have to. There's no way they don't. They attack everywhere. Put some makeshift walls. And then we'll build one more ammo producer. Just for good measure, because you can never ever have too many. Not possible. Looks like we're doing okay on the iron right now. The session gets spookier and spookier as every minute rolls on. So we got three producing ammo right now. It's not fast enough. Uh, have a little bit of coal. Have a lot of coal. I'd be shocked if I can actually keep up with this. Power is fine. So ammo should be getting pushed down now. That's nice. Dump a few more turrets over here because this area is kind of hot. I shouldn't keep losing stuff here. It's kind of wasteful. Makes the biters feel like they're gaining ground on me too, which is not good. Can't give them any morale boosts. So that's good there. Green is doing great. Green is doing great things right now. This lab is doing absolutely not really anything. You go there. Red is disappointing me greatly right now. Red, my son, what have you done? Put that there and then that there. So this will be a one more. So you're going to be gears here. And then this is going to be red science. And then that's going to go there. I feel like this line just doesn't get enough iron anymore. There you go. Some of these still don't offload, like those ones there. Uh, raw iron ore, I think we need just a little bit more. Where can I get some? Uh, maybe this line here. I'll relocate this line. Where 
Relocating. Only to expand the factory. So then these should all be getting ammo or raw ore. One more coming. Steal all those. Automation 2. We're doing it. Really worried about the next tier of biters. That's when things get really bad. When the biters evolve in size on us. This is no longer hooked up properly. Now it is. Uh, I could put a chest right here. And the chest will have a no buffer. Maybe a little tiny buffer. Sure. That actually work? I don't know. Looks like it's working. Actually, you know what's better than that? A belt. Because I don't actually want a buffer. I don't want a chest that dies on me. That would be bad. Good, 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 good. Okay, we got green science going. Red is red is flying off the shelves here. Simply flying off the shelf. A couple more turrets. I don't even want to look at what Biter Evolution is at right now. Copper has probably been not producing for a while. Grab some more coal. I need to grab the coal from those burner miners. The biters haven't attacked me for a while, which is actually terrifying. The longer they wait, the bigger the attack is, which is not good for me. A smaller attack is better. This looks kind of hurt down here. Looking a little bit hurt over here. You go there. No more furnaces. Kind of spooky. Hundred and four bullets sitting in there. Oh, nice. Furnaces is okay. Don't panic. Don't panic, everybody. I think we're okay. I'm gonna say we're okay on turrets right now, but we're really not. Actually, don't think we can ever be okay on turrets, just because we have yellow bullets. Which are absolute garbage. Science is doing okay though. Red can't keep up. Which I'm kind of surprised to see. I'm going to dump a radar here. Radar uses quite a bit of power. Which means I need to add a little more power generation. Uh, what do we? Where do we want to add this? Kind of a mess of turrets here. Kind of a mess of turrets. So I think if I run the this this way instead, go this way, do an underground, start putting the power closer to our base. Look at that. This is a this is a beautiful factory. We're showing the biters who's in charge here. Of course we realize we just disconnected the power there. No problem. Throw that there. Who we so ammo is backing up on us. This belt is completely full, which is awesome. I'm going to grab a couple more turrets. Iron is... It's okay, I think. Ammo is building. I don't even know if we're being attacked like regularly anymore. I can't tell. I can't tell. I'm just so, super hyper-focused right now. That's doing good over there. It's still red. Red's my weakest link right now. Power is okay. Could start building grenades, I think. Um, yeah, let's start making some grenades. Iron and coal. 
It is backlogging on me here. Which means we're mining enough. But... I can't even tell where we're mining. I just see corpses everywhere. I, I literally can't see anything here. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's a beautiful mess. It's just corpses. Uh, how much more is on this patch? This patch is 300k on it. That's not very much. 360. Yeah, it's pretty sad. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> whoa. That's uh, kind of nasty looking. Our best defenses are on this side, though. So, it's a lot of turrets here. We have uh, 19 turrets on that side. This side is being attacked. I think they're going to hit me both sides at the same time. So look how much iron's being used every time you shoot like that. Probably attack the north soon, too. Bring all their White Walker friends with them. Okay. 160 in that chest. That's great. I probably can kind of chill out on this chest a bit. Because my belts are very... Not that long. Grab that. Hello, biters. Have you noticed that I'm here yet? I want to say I think they noticed that I'm here. Ooh, here we go. Oh, yeah. What you got? Welcome welcome to the wall of death. <laughs> uh, we're only like half an hour in this playthrough, and this is, this is what we're dealing with. That's what they're dealing with. They're like, what the heck is going on? Who is this guy? What have you done? They're like, normally that works. <laughs> what is this? Yeah, those turrets just stomped them. They didn't even get to the walls properly. Back to making iron properly. That's good. Teching. Next tech is military science. I want to start making grenades. So we have the coal right there. I'm not getting really any extra iron, though. What I could do... Oh, we can make grenades, like, right here. Grenades on demand. So we have coal right there. Hey! Okay. 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 They're not messing around. They're kind of messing around, but not really. Now we have this right here. Then I can make my grenades right here. Uh, uh, uh. This will be my grenades. It's kind of a wacky setup, but I like it. I like it. So you go first. Your second. Mm -mm. And we need to add a wall in front of that for uh, defensive purposes. So there we go. We're making grenades. We're not making nearly enough coal pulling out of the ground here. That should help a bit more. Make a couple more turrets down here too. Grenades we're going to put onto a belt. That's used for military science anyways, so... Cool. Grenades build about the speed of molasses. Literally the slowest thing in the world to make. But each grenade is pretty uh, detrimental to the biter population. 
they'll remember me when they see a grenade. Uh, coal is not keeping up anymore. My two coal miners. Not producing enough. Let's sneak another one over there in a minute. Three might be enough. Each one gets one. Might be enough. So we have uh, four whole grenades right now. Iron is mostly keeping up. Science is tech. Wow, we're teching really fast. We are flying through this tree. Uh, I got this, and then we have this. Ooh. Ooh. How much science is left here? So we have 30, 50, 150, 200. 250, and I'm at flamethrower turrets, essentially. Um, I need to build some engines, and I need 50 military science. That's it, just 50. Not too, too much. Once we get that going, we can... Uh, look at that. That's beautiful. That would be beautiful. Once we get that, we can really defend this factory. It doesn't really matter what the biters do. Just hear random guns going off. What is going on? What is going on? What are you biters doing? Okay, so we do have military science tech. I just need to make 50. We don't have any steel right now. And by any, I mean we literally have no steel. Zero steel. So, you start getting a little bit of steel. This is steel. And I'm gonna hide it. Just put on a belt to somewhere. Because this area here is scary. Okay, look at that. Look at that. Would you look at that? Okay, so we got steel going on. It's a nice little base. We got like a little, uh, little shape going here. <laughs> it's a shape. We're doing it. We're doing it. But yeah, I think we'll stop the episode there as we are flying through the tech. Almost halfway done fluid handling. And uh, once we get to the flamethrower, we are rocking and rolling. And then we start expanding very aggressively. So I hope you enjoyed the episode. And until next with me, this is Yamakara. Ciao for now.